Hey, young people. Uh, they posted this on Think Like a Cop Facebook page, and uh, <laughs> I mean, there's some people that are saying the cop's kind of wimpy. He is kind of wimpy, kind of running in the way he hits, but nobody wants to deal with a naked guy attacking um, you because a lot of PCP users. Because the heart rate goes up, it's a stimulant, they get really hot, they rip their clothes off, they usually look for water, they become immune to pain, and they can do a lot of damage with extraordinary strength. So, you don't want to fight a PCP guy by yourself. You're going to lose. I don't care how small he is and how big you are. Uh, but, when people are naked, a lot of cops are like, he might be on PCP. I don't really want to get involved, he'll end up taking my gun and killing me. So that's kind of the frame reference that why I'm justifying why these cops are running. The cops like, look, dude, stay away from me. And the guy is coming, he's pepper spraying him. He's got a long gun, doesn't want to shoot him. Pepper spray pretty much has Perfect effect. Somebody sent us ass food. He's still a pepper spray guy. So he's pepper spray the crap out of this guy. He runs over and basically rubs it all over some other dude in his car. Choking him. This guy. Okay, that's got to be about the wimpiest police baton I've ever seen. Um, but let's look at this guy. Um, who thinks deadly force is authorized here? Can this guy shoot this guy? I think he can. If I see cops running from somebody, and then that person grabs me, me personally, I'm in fear of my life. And if I'm in fear of my life, of seriously bodily injury and or death, and if this guy's choking me, he's going to kill me, he could break his trachea, this guy has reasonable fear deadly force is authorized. Of course, if he's turned in his guns like a good little idiot citizen, sheep, then he can't defend himself. So he has to wait for government to come save him with their baton strike. Music. I'll mute that. Suspect is triple homicide is in custody. Suspect is Pennsylvania or Pittsburgh? What the hell is that? Hang on, let me stop this and show you what the title is here. What the hell is that? It says CBS Austin. I don't know what the hell's going on, where this is at. So this guy pretty much says, hey, you know what? He ran this way. There's other cops waiting to Calvary. They send the dog on this guy, and the dog, because, here's a newsflash, people. Canines have never been trained to attack a naked person. Well, why not, Rick? That, that seems like you... Because we can't get anybody to volunteer. And if you'd like to volunteer, we'd be more than happy to take you. But most people getting bit have clothes on, wraps, etc., so when he sends it on the naked guy, the dog gets confused. He's never done it before. This is the first time he's seen a guy with no clothes, and he was told to bite, and he's used to biting people with clothes and jackets and protective armbands and big suits to protect him. And so this is why the dog doesn't bite him, I think. The dog's like, what's going on? Who am I looking for? Where's the people with clothes? Now, I think once the once the officer gets on the ground with him and starts fighting with him on the ground, the dog kind of gets the clue. Oh, shit, my dad's fighting with this dude. I better bite whoever dad's touching that ain't dad. So I think if the dog jumps on him, there might be a little bit of yelling here. So I don't know if the dog got him or not. They take him into custody. If this guy was wanted for a triple homicide, I'm not sure why the cop didn't shoot him. Uh, 
But again, I'm pretty sure the guy's on PCP. He doesn't know what he's doing. Uh, you know, again, naked people. Cops are always paranoid of naked people because you just never know what they're on. And, uh, you know, there's just too many stories where they have done things like pull up large trees and rip shotguns out of the metal bolted to the floor. They rip them out of the squad car and, you know, they rip holsters off cops' duty belt. And, I mean, it's just when you hear all these stories all the time, what PCP does somebody, at that kind of, you know, Give, gives you a mindset, you better be careful with naked people. Unless, you know, you walk in on an orgy and they're all just, you know, not, not doing crazy stuff. But anyway, I digress. All right, we'll end that there.